Thank you for coming out on a Saturday morning. Uh, it was my decision to move one of the most important parts of the uh, meeting to a Saturday morning. And uh, thank you very much for making that not a totally stupid uh, decision. As my predecessors will well know, the choice of the presidential guest lecture is a cause of many sleepless nights. I have to admit that over the years, in auditoriums around the world, whilst listening to similar presentations, my mind has occasionally drifted away from the topic being presented to thinking, if it ever happened that I was offered the chance to choose a guest lecturer, who would I choose? In those good old days, the choice seemed to be quite easy, a technically interesting exercise and lots of names seemed to come to mind. But when faced with the reality of choosing a guest lecturer, it became significantly more difficult. So I started off with a short list and that then became somewhat longer. The person I was looking for needed to be articulate, enthusiastic, inspirational, a real contributor, contributor to the field of paediatric orthopaedics. Someone who was always thinking and thinking laterally. Someone who I admire. Someone who embodies what the new Europe is all about. By this stage, my long list was actually becoming quite short. And then, in the middle of a regional core curriculum course in Lithuania, whilst I was being given some gentle advice about the colour of my slides and would I please not use red on my slides, it suddenly became crystal clear who my choice of guest lecturer should be. So my long list came down to one. My presidential guest lecturer I have learnt much from, not just the colour choice of my slides. To me, he is Europe, he is EPOS. I met him at my first board meeting, and since then, his friendship, common sense, unfailing good humour, courtesy, kindness and professionalism have been an inspiration to me. He is the consummate professional. It came to me rather late in the day, i.e. in the early hours of this morning, that I should be using this opportunity to list his many achievements, his publications, contributions to our literature, his teaching ability, and many other such things. However, the truth of the matter is that he contributes all the time in all, in all ways. From those simple little things like, Deborah, please remember to take your medal with you, to the most important things of basic scoliosis research. He spent the last year telling me he is the ex-president, that he represents the past. I know that he represents the future of EPOS as well. And I'm very glad that he is here in the present, ready, willing and able, I hope, to deliver a presidential guest lecturer. Maharam Mazik.